I gotta tell you, when I saw Don walk in here, the same dress Olivia's got on, I thought it was gonna be fireworks for sure. But look how well they're getting along, huh? Who knew? Yeah, who knew? Yeah. And, uh, I gotta thank you. For what? Well, for welcoming Olivia into the family. I mean, I really, I, I appreciate the effort. I really do. And don't you worry, all right? You're gonna see that this marriage, smart move. So you, you make it sound like it's a business deal. No, I really do want you to be happy. I know you do. I know. And I am. I am. I just want to be even happier once I prove that Phil's behind uh, pulling the strings over Diane Nest at the Port Olivia. Mm -hmm. Olivia! Oh. I understand that you're a bride again. Congratulations. Hey, who knows? Maybe the fourth time will be a charm. It's a private party. And did I get this right? A jailhouse wedding? That's even more romantic than you strong-arming me into marrying you out at Ravenwood. Although, I guess I was certifiable. What, um, what was your excuse, Bill? Well, Philip, Olivia and I got married for the same reason other people get married. We're in love. I think you're just uh, a little sore that your little stunt to get her deported didn't work. My stunt? Yes. Philip, don't you want to say hello to your charming cousin? Oh, of course I do. Hi, Dinah. Hi. How are you? Surprisingly well. Good. We've got a lot to catch up on. More by the minute. Mm -hmm. However, I, one thing I'd like to say first, Bill, about my uh, so-called attempt to... Could I just talk to you for a minute over here privately? Happy to. What's up, Billy? You know you don't belong here. So Bill hasn't figured it out yet, huh? Figured out what? That you were the one that tried to get rid of Olivia? But your plan backfired. He married her. <laughs> now you're stuck with her. It, life is so deliciously filled with irony sometimes, isn't it? He really knows how to ruin a party, doesn't he? Yeah, well, I'll tell you something. I'm glad he's here. It means we're getting to him. That beats champagne and wedding gifts, right? Well, let's see. Excuse me, right? Yeah. What's up? Plenty. Philip had a scale model made of Springfield. No, 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 no. The new and improved Springfield, according to his plan, and everything has his name on it. There's the Spalding Civic Center, and there's the Spalding Stadium, and there's the Spalding Space Needle. Well, I'm kidding about the Space Needle, but you have got to get down here and bring a camera. We have to document this. We can give it to the press. We can show them what Philip is capable of if we don't stop him. Well, you know Philip is going to put his own spin on it. Listen, it's, he's going to say it's good for the economy, blah, blah, blah. But listen, how are we coming on the, uh, on the Olivia front? No. I've looked every place I can think of. Unless... Unless what? You find something? Maybe. Listen, just get down here with the camera. I'll be right there. All right. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I gotta go. That's Harley. I gotta help her with something. Right now you have to go? Yeah, it's something that will help us get some information on Philip, all right? And that's, that's why we got married, right? To really nail this guy, okay? Yeah. So it won't be long, mm -hmm. all right? Okay. Trouble in paradise already? <laughs> 